Hey guys, I'm Fuse here, and I have a tutorial requested about After Effects. I'm going to be showing you how to do this effect here. What about the effect here? between two color corrections almost instantly. So that's the request tutorial on After Effects. So when After Effects opens, I've already opened it but the computer's running a bit slow. So what you're gonna do first is import your file. Let's find a file. What's this? Oh yeah I just got this about ten minutes ago. So you're going to want to control X which you pick it up and then control V twice which makes two layers of it and you're going to be able to do this two ways one's with um, magic bullet looks which is the way I'm going to do it and then you can do a normal colour correction but I'm going to do it magic bullet looks so what you're going to do first is click on the bottom layer go to effect go to magic bullet looks and then looks and edit I already have presets for magic bullet looks um, and if you want those presets just ask so open look file and then I'm kinda gonna want to look for a light one so kinda clean that looks quite clean a bit too clean but doesn't seem to be changing cleanness. Right, so and I want to do this. Maybe that's ultra yellow. You don't need to do all this, this is just me making this because I like it this way. The second bit's going to be a lot easier. I've done this right then. I think I've done this wrong. Done it fucking wrong. There we go. Not the best, but whatever. Right, so I've got this on one. You can't see the thing. Then on the top one, you're going to go to Effect. And this has probably been like two minutes already, see? So it doesn't really matter about any of this, but this is just to. And I want a kind of dark one for this. So there. Right, so what you're going to do is go to the bit where you hit the trick. And this doesn't seem to move. Right, so I had it like here. Right, there we go. And then you go to effect, um, distort, CC lens. So it brings up this kind of bubble, and then what you want to do is make a zero so you're at the absolute point, and then go to the top one, bring it down, effect, CC lens, and then put on size, put click this so you put a wee thing in, and then go a couple of flame, frames along, and then put the size to 100. So you can see it's changing the colour. And then that should auto update itself. And then go another couple of bits along. So I'm going to go to about here. And then put it all the way up to 500. So it's gone. 
So what I'm going to do is RAM render it a bit, just to show you what it is, and um, that will show you a bit. This is one of RJP's tutorials, I'll put a link in the description. He makes really good tutorials as well, so um, yeah, you should go check him out. Definitely go check him out. Um, what else can I show you? Yes. I made this tutorial earlier on. How to make 3D text in a picture frame like my background. Backgrounds. Because they like to move, but this can't be bothered closing down. You guys in Fusio. I'll make a tutorial <laughs> on how to do this. So basically it showed you how to make like these backgrounds with like like see the kind of shadow underneath the floating text there? Shouldn't really be floating but I made this one in a hurry. Once it changes. <laughs> right, I'll come back once that's RAM rendered. Look, there's another one with backgrounds. Right, I'll come back when I once that's RAM rendered and I'll show you what it's meant to look like. Okay guys, it's RAM rendered and I'm just gonna show you a bit now. So this is just a clip. That's the hit. Oh, oh, the fanboy reaction. Oh, oh Jordan. No YouTube! And here's the effect. Oh! It looks really sexy. Just, the kind of oh. bubble effect, oh. it just like... Oh my God. I don't know, it's just... If you get a good oh. colour correction for two of them, no YouTube. Um, then it looks extra sexy. Oh! Um, if you want to tutorial on how to get magic build looks for free, either you can just go look at one. Oh. The existing ones, oh or you just leave a comment, and I'll definitely make one. No, so I'll render this out and put it at the end of the video, just to oh. show you what it looks like on full screen. Probably put a bit of music to it as well. But um, oh. this has been a fuser. Oh. Out. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. YouTube. Oh. Oh my god. Yes. Oh, oh my god. That was good.